What's up, nerds? I hope you guys are having a fantastic whatever day it is, wherever you're having your day. Uh, this fortnight on Project Nerdy, we are discussing our Halloween costumes 2017, and so I am recording this really quickly on my lunch, just to try and get things in, um, and show you this costume that obviously I, I have on. I'm very excited about this costume because I've been working on it um, for a while. I've been dreaming about it for a while. And um, Amazon really came in clutch for me this year. They, um, I got lots of stuff off of Amazon for this costume. So I'll try and put links in the description below um, to the pieces that I got in case you want to also get them. So um, if you were wondering, this is a kind of a modern-ish uh, Prince Adam, Prince Human Beast costume. I'm not really sure exactly what to call it. If those of you, if Kat or anybody has a better concise description for what this costume actually is, let me know in the comments below. Actually, let's make that my question for today. What would you call this costume or categorize this costume as? Um, so let's go through it real quickly. I'm just wearing some hipstery shoes and a pair of dark wash jeans. Um, I have this blue blazer that I got from, from Amazon which is still wrinkled in a couple places. I need to steam it. Um, I also got this rose pin off of Amazon. It is so pretty, you guys. It has a little some rhinestones and things and this colored glass and it is just absolutely gorgeous. And I also got this yellow scarf off of Amazon. This wig as well came from Amazon. You guys, I'm so excited about this wig. Um, it is a $15 wig that I got. Again, I'll try and link in the description. I can tell I've got a hair in front of my glasses. <sighs> I haven't had hair in front of my glasses in a long time. It's annoying and wonderful. Um, anyways, it was a $15 wig. It already came with so much curl in it. And I took it to a local hairdresser, a friend of mine, Brittany Smith. I'll put her Instagram in the link below because she's wonderful and does a great job. I met her when we were when I was doing hairspray and she did the wigs for that show. So I messaged her and said, hey, I'm thinking about buying a wig. Would you style it for me? And she said, yes, of course. So let me see if I can get this shot right so that you can see um, the back of it. But like, it is the most gorgeous thing um, ever. It has this style to it that could work for the Beast or for Belle or if I wanted to do a gender bent Belle someday. Um, it was fantastic and she was so gracious to to do the styling for me. Um, I'm just stoked. I'm, I'm stoked. I'm excited about it and about this costume. So yeah, it's kind of got a hipster vibe to it. Um, it's kind of got a little bit of a you know, modern, casual, I don't even know. Let me know in the comments because I'm having a really hard time explaining this costume to people, to be honest. And my nerdy pleasure this fortnight was uh, going to see Victoria and Abdul in theaters. Yes, guys, I went and saw a movie in the theater. It was awesome. And Judy Dench killed it, as if anybody was going to have any doubts. Um, so I went to see that yesterday, impromptu, no, yeah, it's Saturday, impromptu with my mom and my grandmother. We had a day out and, um, it was really exciting. I'm excited to wear this costume. Um, and if wigs work out, I may get some for like my real life because I miss having hair, you guys, to be honest. So, um, that's all I have for you guys today. I'm almost over time. So peace and blessings and Holly, we'll see you on Wednesday, girl.